Hey guys, Toby Morrison here. Welcome to today's episode of Moving Forwards with Compassion. One thing with chronic fatigue syndrome and recovery is that it can feel quite hard a lot of the time and you feel disheartened and you know a lot of the time you get into probably self-pity mode or beat yourself up or don't celebrate your successes or your progression um, as, as far as you know you have come. And what happens with that is we start to get into this negative cycle of constantly beating ourselves up, constantly thinking we could be doing more or should be doing more, um, or you know, self-sabotaging ourselves. So firstly, I just want to say, you know, you're doing an incredible job. If you're going through this journey, you're going through it for a reason, um, and you know, there's going to be many reasons and many learning lessons along the way. But one of the most important things that you can do for yourself right now is move forwards with compassion in yourself. I think one of the most important things we can do as human beings is not beat ourselves up because it's not that useful for you, it's not that useful for your journey, it's not useful for the people around you either. So rather though, if you do have a bad day, if you have a bad week or if you're not doing the right things, you know, just be okay with it. Be okay with it, you know, you, yeah, it might be a bad day and that's okay, but tomorrow's a new day. The most important thing is walking and moving forwards with compassion because if you do that, you'll realize that you can be kind to yourself. You know, um, Stop treating yourself like a bully and instead start to treat yourself like you would treat others. Start to see greatness from other people in yourself rather than constantly looking at the lack of, start to look at the full of within you, if that makes sense. So I just wanted to share with you this short video to start moving forwards with compassion, start moving forwards with a bit of self-love. Um, you know, if you, if you do fall off the bandwagon or if you do start, you know, self-sabotaging or procrastinating, it's okay. It's not the end of the world. You don't have to beat yourself up about it. Acknowledge it, have the awareness about it, and then shift your focus to, you know, moving forwards in the right direction. Because that's really what it's about. And just ask yourself, like, what do I need to do to help myself right now? But doing it in a compassionate way that doesn't come from desperation or anger or, or sadness, but comes from a place of um, calmness and ease so you can move forwards in the direction that you want to go uh, without the struggle um, that you may have in the past. I hope that resonates with some of you. Uh, I know some of you might not um, get it or you might not uh, resonate with it, but that's okay. Um, make sure you subscribe to this video channel because I'll be uploading uh, lots of question and answers. And if you do have a question, uh, that you would like answered, just comment below and I'll make sure I read it and, uh, and answer any of, you, uh, any of the questions that you have. Have a lovely day and I'll speak to you soon.